Okay, so I want to go ahead and I'm doing this video to keep it for myself as a record. But also, God is going to use this whole situation as a testament to how God comes through and provides. Okay, so let me go ahead and just share. So, my lease is up on the 31st. That means next week. I do not have one clue of where I'm going. All I know is that the Lord told me that I'm leaving, that I'm going. He also told me that well, he told me a year ago that I will be doing traveling ministry. That means wherever I go, wherever the Lord sends me, I'm going to be praying for people. I'm going to be encouraging people, whatever the Lord has for me, because I gave God my yes. Whatever he has, wherever he tells me to go, I'm going. With that being said, I know my God to be a provider. Now, I have, within the last five years, seen God move amazingly in my life. In the last five years, first and foremost, you know what? I'm not even going to get into that. I have seen God move at this very moment right now. Um, there's no, I don't have any plane tickets, <sighs> storage, wondering where my car is going to go. At this very moment, there are a lot of things that are up in the air, but because I know God, because I have experienced God being my provider, I know that God will make a way. I know, like I know, like I know that God is making a way right now. I'm like, God, you even see my bank account right now. So whatever it is your will is for me, you have to make a way for it. Where you want me to go, you have to provide for me to get there. You have to to provide. I am looking to you as being my provider for absolutely all of this because this is your will, not mine. I gave you my yes, but I'm also giving you my trust. Here's another thing. The ministry that the Lord has started in me is called trusting faith. What that means is I have to move in faith like I trust God. I have to move in faith without even seeing or even knowing where I'm going. That is trusting God by faith. So the ministry that he gave me to walk in, to move in, is not just a name. It is a way of living. It's a way of life. So at this very moment, I am doing this video because I want to see God provide absolutely everything. I even told the Lord and I've been telling the Lord, I'm not putting my hands in this at all because this is not my will. This is yours. I'm not putting my hands in this. I'm not worrying about this. I'm not trying to figure this out. I'm not doing none of that. Because this is your will, not mine. So, let me let me just share with you something that just happened within the last 24 hours. Now, I work with my hands. I have been making books as the Lord has led me. I have the ministry website where there's digital ebooks. There's, well, I just shut down the, the production of books, but... I was making books and selling books as the Lord led. I also have a business where I do crafting and craft work. 
I have been more focused on the ministry and less focused on the craft, the craft business. But let me tell you what God did within the last 24 hours. I still have, you know, things that I got to pay even above the plane tickets, the accommodations, the transportation, the storage. Okay. So I simply, I'm packing up and everything. Anyway, within the last 24 hours, I received an email from somebody that wants to do a custom order. A custom order. And it's a repeat customer. Somebody that I've already, you know, done work for before. But just out of the blue, they came and said, hey, you know, I want this. Can you do this? I'm getting ready to go through a move, but it's probably better for me to do it before I move because Ain't no telling when I'm going to get my stuff or I'm going because the Lord is taking me out of the country. So let me just go ahead. And so as you know, I'm getting an idea of what this person wants. And I, I let them know what the base price was for that. So then they come back and we're just like, well, eh, my budget is this. And so I'm just like, okay. They were like, can you do this? Because, you know, this was the price of, you know, what we got before. And I'm just like, eh, well, it's going to take longer for me to do what, you know, the alterations are in comparison to what you initially came and brought to me. So how about this? If you work with me, I work with you. I will do initially what you wanted. But. If you can work with me on the price, I'll work with you. I won't charge you the base price than what I normally would, but I'll work with you on it. They was like, okay. So I'm sitting here like, wow, look at God. And it's just enough for me to take care of something that I have been needing. Actually, that's about to be needed for tomorrow. And so now I'm sitting here like, wow, God, out of the blue, you just allowed that to happen. So I expect God to continue to come through every day and provide absolutely in every way for what he has in store for me to do. I'm not worrying about it. I'm not thinking about it. I'm not trying to figure it out. I'm simply trusting God. And the reason why I said I was making this video is because this is the beforehand of me seeing what God is doing or is about to do. And obviously, with me posting this video, everybody else is going to see it too. Because God knows when he does something amazing in my life, I go and I tell people that. I let people know. I let the world know just how awesome and amazing my God is and how much of a provider that he is. So, I'm just putting this out there right now. Just watch. I'm going to share. And I'm sure there will be a full testimony. But at this moment, I'm doing this video to let you know God is doing something.